To see Toast notifications at work, let's create a new Visual Studio project. We'll make that a Windows Store blank application and call it Toast Notifications. The very first thing that we want to do is to get the NuGet package for notifications extensions. Let's search online. Finding the package we want, we will install it. We can close the NuGet package manager and we are ready to create our application. The very first thing we're going to do is to create a simple main page and on mainpage.xaml we're going to add a button which will say display toast. We're ready to turn to the event handler so let's go to mainpage.cs scroll down to the event handler and we're going to create an instance of iToast notification content. We'll hit control dot to bring up IntelliSense to add the necessary using statement which is in the notification extensions library that we just got through NuGet. The next thing we're going to do is to get one of the templates from the Toast content factory. And now that we have a template, we can set the body text for that template. And we can set the Toast content equal to the template content. We're now ready to create the notification. Toast notification needs a using statement as well. With that in place, we can ask the Toast Notification Manager to create a Toast Notifier. And finally, we can tell the Notifier to show our Toast. That's all it takes to create a Toast Notification programmatically from within your application. Let's run the application and see if it brings up the toast. And when we click the display toast button, the toast appears in the upper right hand corner. We can click it again and get a second toast. The toast can be clicked on. It can be dismissed by clicking the X. Or if you just ignore the toast for a few seconds, it will eventually fade away.